from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul. Man, this game's boring. <sighs> Isn't there any good game out there that's free? <laughs> Boy, did you do with League of Legends? What's happening? Did somebody say free? Because League of Legends is one of the most popular free games in the world. Yeah, but isn't that game pay to win? Wait, what did you just say? Isn't that game pay to win? <laughs> Not pay to win, skills to win. You don't have to pay a single cent to win against someone who's paid hundreds of dollars in the game. It's all about Look teamwork and your own there. skills playing champion. Wait, what's a You're champion? Well, let me that. show you. Look at this. You want to be a super robot with giant extendable rocket hands? This is champion. Want to be a ninja assassin with a shadow clone jutsu and literally teleports behind you? There's a champion for that. Want to be a celestial dragon orbited by stars that throws little galaxies at you, breaking the very fabric of the universe? <laughs> for that. Oh, uh, can I be an armadillo? Boom, you got it. Armadillo. All right. Over 140 champions to choose from, each with different play styles and abilities. Now, if you call within the next 10 minutes, because you know we can't do this all day, I'll throw in my brand new game mode, Team Fight Tactics, absolutely free. This is a brand new strategy game mode where you build up a team of champions to fight against others to be the last man standing. Throw in ARAM, which is always good fun, and that's three game modes for the price of zero dollars. It's actually free. I know. I'm crazy. We're gonna make the world play lol again one slap at a toy here's how to order
premium. Sign up for the student plan today and get one month free.
fees that light work with the bass on the track on my face in the back like I'm taking a slap I need a drink but it's straight from the tap and I'm hating the slack couple miles slide around like the hate in the gaff please stop talking that trash cause the vibes in the front all the way to the back Michael, 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 what did you do? The rings, the bling, the logo, the legacy, and the story. Nah. We breaking ankles, we breaking records, coast to coast, overseas, in the paint, above the rim, at the buzzer. But it didn't stop there. We're on the diamond, we're on the pitch, we in the big house, the big east, the big game. Rhyming, dancing, skating, riding, no breaks, no limits. Chris is bowing? We on the stage, off-white, flashing lights, cameras, action, fighting bad guys, being bad guys, on the runway, making runway, taking off from the foul line. Didn't MJ already do that? Nah, the other foul line. We in orbit, on Mars, speaking of Mars. We're back in the day. Are we winning statues now? We're a family, no I, ours. What did you do? Overthinking, oh 
Dance Players. Pursuing lives of adventure, warfare, and prosperity. Overthinking, 
selling facial cleansers. Yeah, in terms of blood pressure, our pressure station was 68, 36 millimeter mercury. Yeah, she had a pause on only two. I grew up here in Liberia, in the capital city, Monrovia. When I was growing up, I woke up one morning and my sister was on the floor whispering to me. And she says, oh, you can get up, but you have to roll on into the floor. You can't stand up. What I didn't realize was happening was that someone was trying to take over the government. So you couldn't be seen by the window. So potentially you could be shot. We had a fantastic life here. We were very comfortable. But my parents made that sacrifice for us to go to the US. And you know, we were lucky to leave before the start of the Civil War. At the time, I didn't know these things were happening. I was just kind of happy to be going to school. It was only after I joined the Navy at 18 that I really kind of started to understand the war. On deployment, my ship went to Brazil. I met a Liberian who was in Rio. And that's why I was like, wow, that's when I really first realized how displaced people were during the war. 
So after that deployment, I wanted to work with like refugees and displaced people. Good morning, how are you doing? That's how I started turning to medicine. Does it be tingling too? Yeah, very normal. I feel that numbness. For how long do you think? Mm. Yeah. I used to clean toilets in the Navy before when I first joined. It's just been completely amazing to have come up through the ranks and be a doctor. Yeah, they need to watch that fluid. Yeah. She's really wet on the right side. The military has a tropical medicine program where we go to uh, several countries, work with the local doctors on how to uh, manage diseases. Yeah. India, Thailand, Brazil, Tanzania, Honduras. I've been to almost 40 countries. And then, then it's gone a direction I hadn't thought it would go which is to bring me back home. The whole nation as a whole, I don't think, has healed. But that's why I feel like I must come back and help. When I took over the position as a director of the program, I established a field mission here so I could bring doctors here. My name is Dr. Declan T. Adams with the U.S. Navy. I'm a naval officer. I've been fortunate to come to Phoebe to work, bringing a team of doctors to observe tropical medicine cases. When people think about Liberia, they think about our civil wars and they think about Ebola. I want to do something about that. Imagine being in the shoes of some of these doctors and nurses who are treating people every day. Some places not having gloves, not having medications in the pharmacy. We're trying to build capacity and capability for our, the hospitals that we work with. And we'll also provide academic exchange. So the first lecture is medical waste. That's so for we give us. some lectures, they also give us some lectures. Everything we have two doctors assigned to me. You know, he's just trying to have a positive influence on people's lives. I still feel that I'm not doing enough because I'm only here two weeks. But I do use medicine to accomplish other goals. Sometimes I bring books. Sometimes it's like an art or a literature workshop. How you doing? This time I'm, I'm funding like a dance contest. Anybody that wants to dance can come on stage and dance. But you know, I, I give myself job. a hard time about not doing enough. It's I also appreciate that jobs. doing something small is also impactful. So we made one job easier. Saving for your child's education. Just open a New York 529. The education I mean, think about the military, think about the Navy, you think about conflict. I didn't know about all the global health engagement activities we're involved in. And it's been a pleasant surprise. It's been a wonderful experience and opportunity to come back home. <laughs> but um, I hope Liberia gets to a point where it's not relying on development and aid, where it is so self-sufficient. To get all the experiences that I have around the world and get him to come home, I realize that sometimes all it takes is one act in somebody's life to change the course of their life. And so that's why you can't stop.
because you don't know what act it's going to be. My name is Nikanti Adams. I'm an infectious diseases physician in the United States Navy.
Parents have many jobs. Family chauffeur is just one. Saving for your child's education is another. Make that second one easier with a New York College Savings Plan. It's simple, has real tax benefits, and it won't drive you crazy. The rings, the bling, the logo, the legacy, and the story. Nah. We breaking ankles, we breaking records, coast to coast, overseas, in the paint, above the rim, at the buzzer. But it didn't stop there. We're on the diamond, we're on the pitch, we in the big house, the big easy, the big game. Rhyming, dancing, skating, riding, no breaks, no limits. Chris is bowing? We on the stage, off-white, flashing lights, cameras, action, fighting bad guys, being bad guys, on the runway, making runway, taking off from the foul line. Didn't MJ already do that? Nah, the other foul line. We in orbit, on Mars, speaking of Mars. From back in the day. Are we winning statues now? We're a family, no I, ours. What did you do? Break the 